What's up, YouTube? This is uh, Catalyst Gaming here with Raid Shadow Legends. Uh, today, I figured I'd be doing a little bit of a shard opening. I got 22 uh, ancient shards and one void shard. And then uh, I thought we might talk about the um, tournament going on now and uh, something I noticed about the shop, some sales that's been going on recently, and uh, my prediction about what they're going to be doing. So. Let's just get right into the uh, shard openings. Uh, I know there's no event going on right now, but uh, I figured, why not? I got 22. I figured you guys may enjoy this. So we'll do the two first, and then we'll just do 10. Excuse me. Honor Guard. Cool. Let's see, attacks one of me. I'm not going to read out uh, all the abilities. I'll just click on it and let you read it. Not bad, but probably just going to be food for me. Oh, wow. Wow. That's not bad. They all say she's bad, but I don't see how. I'm gonna have to play with her. Oopsies. Oh well. Guess we'll just have to go through some of them. We'll do 10 first, though. So. Let's go. Give me some good. Need some legendaries. Need some legendaries. Ooh! Sakura. Eh? I don't know much about her, to be honest. Educator. Alrighty. Let's see what's going on here. Tax one of me feel this turn to try to get back. This tax critical. Tax all of me three times. You should. Not bad. Wow. Not bad. All right. Let's go through them. Go through them pretty quickly here. Trash. To me. You may like her. Oh, not bad. He has a couple of good skills for a... She's a starter champion, but she has a couple of good skills for uh, campaign farming. Running mage, not bad. With the void shard, I'm not really hoping... Ooh, I've been kind of wanting to judge. Uh, the attacks all enemies two times, feel the turn reader for uh, each critical hit. That's a pretty good move. Uh, here real quick. Yeah, he's he's not bad. He's pretty good. Um, but I'm hoping for a bellower from the void shard. I don't have a great campaign farmer. I'll show y'all my team here in a second. But uh, I have a couple good champions. Uh, just not a great team comp yet. Really hoping for an ethos or ethos, however you pronounce his name. Uh, Alright, here we go. Ah, uh, because I want to get into the arena. Alright, Void Shard, here we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Bella, 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 Bella. Oh, who is she? Tax one enemy. Tax one enemy. Decrease. Hmm. Okay. Huh. Maybe good. Uh, fighting like a, a boss or something like that may not be bad. I have to play with her a little bit. Not bad. She's got a cool design. I like the uh, big earrings. The horns are cool. The triple ponytail. It's nice. It's a void. Void rare. Not bad. Uh, arena offense, dragon slayer. Yeah, she got she's got some uh, plausibility. But anyway, on to what I was talking about uh, for the tournament. So here you can see 
We have a get champions by any means necessary, shards, market, campaign, dungeons, etc., and rewards. Uh, as you can see, I just won some rewards. Uh, I'm up for the rare relentless artifacts now. Uh, and I've won energy and some money here. Uh, next up, I'll get some skill tomes, some XP, more skill tomes. So it looks like they're really pushing for some skill tomes here, because uh, people um, ask uh, Polarium for more ways to unlock uh, skill tomes for their champions. Because uh, really, right now, there are no good ways. I mean, you can do uh, your challenges, but after those are up, you know, you're out of luck. Uh, I haven't really been chasing much my uh, challenges too much. Um, I mean, there's good sales every now and then for them, but, you know, other than that, there's not much. And so, here we can see, for Void Champions, you get 50 points, 350 points, and 650 points. And then for the regular champions, you only get 250 for an Epic and 500 for a Legendary. You can do the math. That's a lot of Legendaries and a lot of Epics. Now, if we go into the shop here, conveniently, they're placing Sacred Shards, 99.99. Uh, just yesterday, the day before, something like that, it was one shard for 3.99, or 39.99, and then some gems, I can't remember the amount. Um, but that's giving you chances to get these points. But uh, as we all know, Polarium likes to bait everybody. I believe they're going to use this tournament to get everybody to buy those Lego shards, the sacred shards, uh, bait us to come here, spend all our money, do it, and then after this, it's going to be a double rates event. So look out for that. Um, you know, I have no intel, no inside source or anything. This is just me thinking. But uh, if you if you are interested in this event, go after those skill tomes. I know I need them. I could use these skill tomes right here for uh, my fell hound. I'm trying to get him geared up. Um, but other than that, uh, I really believe that they're going to be doing a double rates event soon for sacreds. Uh, either sacred shards or for um, Legos. So if you're buying these sacred shards uh, in these packs, I would really hold on to them um, for at least until December, I would say, they're probably going to be coming out with a double race event. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, and let me know what you think. Let me know. Uh, do you think I'm just crazy? Do you think I'm trying to just reading into this dude too much? Do you think that this is a good event? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Uh, I'm looking forward to hearing back uh, your response. Uh, thank you very much for watching. This has been Catalyst Gaming with some Raid Shadow Legends. You can look forward to some more content. Thank you very much.